One of the things that a good many people associate with my career is playing transcriptions. That is to say, music that was conceived by the composer for a completely different medium rather than the organ. I certainly love to play the instrument in ways which show its agility, its ability to do kaleidoscopic effects, its ability to equal the nuance of other modes of uh, music performance. Transcriptions are really just one corner of what I've done. I love uh, all organ repertoire, and there is a good many works for organ, especially of the 20th century, which use the same playing techniques as one would use for orchestral transcriptions. Many composers, especially, as I say, in the 20th century, were able to exploit those capabilities. People often ask me how long do I take to prepare for a concert on an organ that I don't really know, and I never want to skimp because to elicit the greatest interpretations from an instrument, you have to know it through and through. It has to be an organ that you are uh, immersed in when you're playing it, even to the extent of forgetting all the other organs you've ever known. In 1980, Charles Krigbaum, the university organist, gave me a call and said, we are going to be advertising for a junior appointment in organ. And he said, I would like you to apply. And of course, having met the organ, the, the Woolsey Hall, great, great world-class instrument, I knew that it was a great opportunity. And so I came and I interviewed and was very fortunate to be hired. Now, the Woolsey Hall instrument is the work of Ernest M. Skinner, a very, very famous 20th century American organ builder who believed that the pipe organ should have all of the nuance and all of the versatility of the orchestra. It's known among organists as an orchestral style of instrument. Having been here now for 38 years, I can truthfully say that the beauties of the Woolsey Hall organ just continue to grow in my mind. And furthermore, I discover even now new combinations of sound that I might not have made use of in earlier years. It's a, it's a vast treasure, it really is. It's an Aladdin's cave of music. <laughs>